Now on BBC One and Sporting Knitwear, as varied as the questions, we join Emlyn Hughes and Bill Beaumont for A Question of Sport. Welcome to Question of Sport, in which Bill Bowman is hoping to continue his winning run of the last two weeks. But Amelie News is still 6-4 in front and looking for some special help tonight from Sam Torrance and Hannah Manikova. Sam, the Scottish World Cup golfer who's won the Portuguese Open twice, the Spanish, Scandinavian, Tunisian and Sanio Open Championships, and the man who holds the winning putt for Europe in the Ryder Cup. And Hannah, the Czechoslovakian tennis star who recently married an Australian who's going to live there now, Winner of the French Open, the American Open, the Australian Open twice, including this year, and he just wants Wimbledon to complete a Grand Slam series. <laughs> well, Bill tonight has called up Charlie Nicholas and Peter Scudamore. Charlie, who first displayed his uh, talents with Celtic's championship side, 17 times a Scottish international, and now enjoying the success of the Arsenal side this season, well placed in the league, and through to the final of the Littlewoods Cup at Wembley. And Peter, who's Britain's top national hunt jockey, twice winner of the championship and the current leader at the jockey's table. <laughs> and don't forget, tonight we start our viewers' mystery guest competition. Well, there's the numbers board, and here's the starter in tonight's match. Charlie Nicholas. Uh, number 10, please. Richard Dunwoody. Uh, Richard Dunwoody. <laughs> Richard Dunwoody won the Grand National last year. You get your two. Right, Hannah, your turn. I go for number one. Ooh. Valerie Brisco Hookers. Hookers. <laughs> Do I have another chance? No, you don't, no. <laughs> it goes to the other side. So who's that? You've got a bonus of two here. Evelyn Ashford. That is right. The Olympic 100 metres champion. And uh, the current world record holder at 100 metres. Hannah, um, coming back to you, actually, I remember your father. He was an international sprinter, wasn't he? Yeah, he was in the semi finals in 56 uh, Olympics game. Yeah. yeah. I can't, if he's watching the show, he can't believe I didn't know it. Like uh, I, that's why I asked you. <laughs> yeah, I know. Well, I choose the number, so. Right, Peter, your turn. I'll go for number four, please. Oh, it's, um, she can't believe it, the Welsh, you know, Kirsty Wade, that's it. Kirsty Wade. Yeah, Kirsty Wade. Kirsty Wade, who got two gold medals in the Commonwealth Games, you get two. <laughs> now, Sam, you're always a star in this programme, aren't you? Eh? Uh, you're just winding well, me up, yeah. No, no, I wouldn't wind you up, would I? Uh, you're six nil down, though. Ah, we've got to give him a wee start. Yeah, yeah. Number eight, please. You won't mind this. Lee Trevino? <laughs> it goes to the other side! <laughs> You've dived in too quickly. He knows who it is now. Mark James. Mark James, yes! <laughs> Bill? Uh, number 11, please, David. You sure? Yeah. Zico. Uh, Zico, the Brazilian um, World Cup star, yeah, right again. <laughs> Evelyn, the last uh, picture in the first round. You haven't scored yet, and your turn. <laughs> Number six, please. <laughs> Thanks, pal. Number six, don't take the mickey. Don't take the mickey. All right. You're not going to find this easy. Oh, I'll give over. <laughs> I'll tell you, the colours are misleading. The colours are misleading? Oh. So he's black. <laughs> Actually, Hannah, if I could give you a point, you'd, you'd have it. 
Is it, is it Jock, isn't he? Gavin Hastings? Gavin Hastings? No, uh, no I'm afraid it's not, Sam. Uh, so it goes to the other side. David Leslie. One of the outstanding players for Scotland, playing in their change colours. Must be playing France. Yeah. Well, it's never happened before. Sam Torrance thinks it's a false start. <laughs> it's not been called. 12 nil. <laughs> well, now for round two, the individual round in which the guests get uh, questions about their own sport, and even the captains do tonight. Right, Charlie, your soccer match is a Merseyside derby in the season 84-85 when Everton and Liverpool finished first and second. This was the winning goal. Who put it past the keeper and who played the ball through? Uh, Graham Sharp scored a goal and uh, Gary Stevens played the through ball. That's right, and that was the winning goal. Everton won one nil. Their first win at Anfield in 14 years. Anna, are you okay? I'm fine. So, sorry about the way life started, know. you know. Question of sport for you. 14. Well, let's, let's, let's go, go for it now. We go we'll for it now. Yeah, come well, come on. Well, you must have seen these two far too often in your career, Everett Lloyd and Navratilova. Lova. They're in action in the early rounds in this clip of the 84 Wimbledon Championship. Who are they playing? know this one I would go home right away <laughs> so the first one was Koda Kilsch, German girl and the second Manuela Maleva and you got the first two for <laughs> Emily's team <laughs> now Peter for you last year's valuable uh, Aintree hurdle race run on Grand National Day and a very tight finish indeed can you name the two horses involved Good race, wasn't it? Very good. Um, Jimmy Duggan on Anok and Steve Smith Eccles on See You Then. The jockey's a bonus, the horse is right. Well, <laughs> I don't feel like confident, you know. So you'll get your two, and we move across to Sam Torrance. Now, Sam, this is a clip from the 115th Open Championship at Turnbury. Who are the two players? Okay? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Raymond Floyd was the first one and Payne Stewart the second. And you got two out of two. Well, we go to Bill. Now, Bill, uh, you're on game tonight and a Welshman scoring a try on his first appearance for his country. Name him and who's the wing joining him to make the try? Who scored? Who was the winger who helped? Uh, my old mate Graham Price scored the try and JJ Williams was the winger. What a first international Fantastic. try. Fantastic, 75 yards. <laughs> Incredible that for a prop. Not, not many props actually want to touch the ball in the game. You know? <laughs> <laughs> I think that was uh, points for Wales there, but yep. points for you, you've got two. Well done, 
Those guys, Mervyn Davies. Right, Emlyn, your go.